Uh, take us through that final couple of possessions. Really close all game long. It was. It was close. A little disappointed. I think we put ourselves in a tough position at the end of the game. I think we missed a couple 50-50 balls to put us in a position where we were down by one. Um, decided to pull the goalie and obviously put pressure on the defensive unit uh, or their offensive unit and, uh, you know, had a chance to, to tie it up at the end. Um, you know, all good things. At least we were in the game. You know, I think the last two games we've kind of unfortunately been outside of, of an opportunity to win. So for today, again, growing opportunities for us and excited to see, you know, where we're at on Saturday. A little bit more prepared for the offensive end at the end of the game, but hopefully we're up by a few more goals rather than uh, being down by one at the end of the game. Now, what does that say about your team, just being able to stay in a close game like this already three games in? Yeah, they're, they're fighting. And, you know, each, each game we've had a different lineup, and we're still trying to figure out what the, the best lineup is and who's working well together and what system is going to be best for us. So, you know, day by day, we're, we're crawling our way out of this hole, and hopefully, um, you know, come Saturday, we'll be able to uh, be ready to get a W. Now, you do welcome Lehigh to the Jacobs Complex. It will be a very difficult game. How do you prepare your team for a quick turnaround? For us, we've got to go back to the basics. I think too many turnovers, unfortunately, today, whether it was ground balls, whether it was, you know, checked balls, draw controls. Um, so for us, honestly, my, my focus for the next two days is going to be basics and for us to make sure that we clean up the game a little bit in order for us to continue to compete. And then hopefully we'll, you know, be again in the, in the opposite column here. Coach, thank you very much. We'll see you this weekend. Thank you, Kristen.